Ladies and gentlemen, how is everybody doing in, in the video, right? I am doing fantastic. Thank you for definitely not asking. So today, we are wasting no time with today's video. We're going to jump right into it in like the next 15 or so seconds. But before we go any further, 80% of you, right? I'm, I'm, I'm talking to you in the background and not subscribe to the channel, right? YouTube statistically has shown me that. So make sure you guys do subscribe and let's see if we can smash 2,000 likes. If we can, that'll be fantastic. Make sure you guys comment done when you have done it. I'll be hearting the first reply for an hour but today we're gonna head over to home raid right it's in the hot bar that means you know we're definitely getting serious and we're in a void again and i can't see where i'm going uh, just reconnect nothing nothing going on here today we are raiding a base that is a giant floating obsidian box and if i f map it is owned by the faction go beast these guys are worth six million dollars and nobody is currently online right they've got a few people in the faction but what we can do is we can use this lovely cannon which i have obviously done by myself by the way by my bad line cape thank you this lovely cannon is hopefully gonna get us into the base as they have like a direct ladder going from like point a up here to point b down here it's it's quite crazy hopefully there is some good stuff in here if you're watching this video there clearly is some good stuff it should stack like one sand i don't even know if it stacked any sand yes it stacked one sand i can see the sand currently which means we're gonna have to do this for a little bit longer uh, we do have sand and stuff in the chest so worst case scenario we'll be okay but it looks like we're making brilliant progress right now right we're right clicking redstone's doing redstone-y things sand is falling everything's working i say this now right and i guarantee in the next 30 seconds something's probably gonna go wrong as it always does which means now daily videos will be occurring as psycho sky has reset everything's reset everything's brilliant okay but it's gonna focus on getting into the base because otherwise we're gonna be here for hours going through a really cool emote uh, like this one this is a fun one <laughs> i like this one so now we're at the point where we basically need to turn on the scatter for the cannon which means that we're gonna do some cool stuff and we're hoping Hopefully gonna break into this base he says i don't think it worked at all okay let's give it one more go as we could have just messed up that last time honestly anybody who's ever doubted me my name is raven i have finally got into a base i am worth something in my life and here we are all right the ladder as you guys can tell is up here i think we actually broke a few chests as well and it all cleared uh, sorry about that i didn't mean to but there is a load of chests down here with oh a pickaxe you got some pickaxes we got some other stuff maybe he says hopefully some potions oh uh, one stack of obsidian we're now rich i'll definitely take that and we will have a look through before we go grab anything else as we need to make sure we don't miss anything because if we miss anything my comments are going to yell at me so let's head up and start working our way up the base uh hopefully i can pearl against this wall i didn't do it <gasps> ah! Ah! okay that's a guy what do i do hello okay i killed him there are spawners here this is just sped up everything all right this is just sped up everything the guy literally just logged on in front of me and peeps his head over the side okay let's um let's focus on getting the spawners we're gonna have to bri fbi bridge and clear i missed lovely okay we're gonna grab a creeper egg because we don't have time for this we do not have time for this blow up jerry um we may have severely messed up i only got oh god jerry what do we do let's just put everything back in the chest all right nothing ever dropped on the floor there's so much good stuff in here that i want but we got... <laughs> we. I'm so scared. He's still online. I'm not exactly sure where he is. But all I need to do right now is grab these spawners, okay? This is my number one priority. He could be getting geared. He could be getting some armor on. We'll drink this eight-minute potion of speed. And we'll just grab these spawners right here. Fifteen horse spawners. Okay, issue. Ah, he's back. Get him again. Okay, we did that. That, that went brilliantly. Okay, now we're out of room in our e-chest and everything. We have no room. Okay, I'm going to head back to home mission. And we're going to have to hope he doesn't come come back and take all the spawners because if he does we're in severe trouble okay we're in severe trouble this guy just logged on peeps his head over the air. oh okay it looks like they've actually added dispensers thank you mission control for doing exactly what i wanted we look okay we look okay let's grab 15 chicken spawners oh my god we are going to be very very rich after this 15 pig spawners and i'm guessing there's also 15 rabbits uh, if we f who go beast this guy is still online uh i'll message him and i will say hello okay this quickly now has to go into these dispensers we have to do this with such urgency. We have to do it with such precision. I have probably found a very toxic player. He just said a very rude word. Why you do this? It's factions. You guys don't know. If you guys are new to the channel, right? This is what factions is all about. It's all about raiding other people, taking other people's stuff. He just took damage. He's down here. I killed another guy. He said, who cares? Why is this guy so mean? Everyone's calling me out. For Dude, I think I found the most toxic faction ever. Okay. He's back again. He just jumped. 
jumped off the edge. You have so much to live for. Okay, let's quickly focus up and get these spawners before we talk to Mr. Toxic Faction. As these guys do not seem like... Okay, he's definitely not a nice person. They're messaging me reported. They think I'm cheat. What? Listen, if I was cheating, could I infinite dab? <laughs> right? That is the question. Let's head back to home raid because I'm actually curious. These guys might be going straight for my cannon. Uh, there's obviously nothing really like important in here. We've got all the spawners for now. Everything's looking fantastic on our part. Okay, let's head back over here and hope that maybe someone is back as I, I would enjoy. <gasps> there's a guy there. No. Okay, listen, we managed to grab the spawners. He's looking at me over the edge. I'm pretty sure I won't be able to get anything else. We did get the spawners though. That's the important thing. But these guys are so toxic. I don't understand why people are like this. I, I get that like obviously it's taking people's stuff, but it's obviously how the server works. It's how the server is played. He has like knocked back a thousand. I'm getting so much abuse from these. Okay, I just want to get back to the base now. I regret not sending. All right, that's the chat. I'm going to have to blurn out because of everything he's saying. Oh God. Okay, let's get into the base. Hope we don't die. Are we in? We are in. Lovely. He can't get us back out now. There we go. We got him. I told him to stop and he said no. I just need to pearl. Set home raid in here. There we go. This has gone fantastically now. So now what we can do, now what we can do is we can have a look through these chests and find out hopefully if there's anything good in here. They've got some creeper eggs, a wither skeleton head. They're just spamming me mean things. I don't get it. Like, obviously, you guys, if you're new to factions, it's a raiding server. The whole idea is to take stuff. But this guy, these guys, sorry, are not taking it very well. We've got some good armor and stuff in here, though. Some stuff we can definitely sell, take some money off. We've already made like four million dollars from this raid and there is is actually more to have a look at. So up here, there are even more levels. Uh, they've got some stuff here. Also got, oh, more spawners in here. Okay, let's grab these actually. Let's grab these now before they come back and kill me. 15 mushroom spawners. We're either gonna have to leave nine or find, okay, there we go, nine spaces. Okay, there we go. Let's head back to home mission, put all this away, and hopefully we can actually start raiding the rest of this base without these guys being too toxic. I mean, I think the line is already passed for toxic players. I think these guys are definitely the angry people I've ever met playing factions. Actually, no, I did a video a while ago on a guy who was probably the most toxic player I've ever met. These guys, I think, are a close second, okay? These guys are definitely up there. We're getting so much, like, cool stuff from this raid. He's messaging me, you are getting banned. I don't know why I'd be banned. I'm I'm playing legitly. I'm doing everything fair. Okay, this guy needs to... There we go. Let's get him out of the way so we can keep raiding. His friend has to be here somewhere, okay? That's what I'm thinking. His friend has to be here somewhere. But now we can have a little look through and see if there's anything good we want to take. Some more pure gold and pure iron. We've got some more diamonds and stuff. I think I'll leave the diamonds. I'm only really looking for like the impure stuff or the pure stuff. Okay, we've got some more impure gems, some mask fragments, definitely some rare stuff inside this base. It's a lot richer than I thought it would be, like with stuff in the chest. I'm actually very, very surprised. We've got some impure quartz as well. We've got a load of cool stuff, some more creeper eggs, a chicken spawner. If I F who go beast. There's the two of those guys online, which are the two people who are being very mean to me currently. I have no idea. Like, I think the other guy is Invis. I think he's Invis somewhere. I thought I just saw some particles. Okay, I don't think these guys are gonna let me raid this very, very easily. I think, to be honest, these guys are gonna keep coming back. They've got some good armor in here as well. We can take all this and start moving it back. A, a little bit of TNT. Also, he came back in daily armor. What a, what a, what a guy. We've got some more creeper eggs, some more obsidian, a lot of rich stuff in this base that we're going to have to move back and forth. We got some impure gold. A lot of stuff is looking quite good. The only thing I'm worried about is him coming back in armor and then me dying because obviously that would not be the greatest thing ever. I think we had to look through most of these chests. It's just got to the point where I just have to repeatedly spawn kill this guy to even like raid the base. Like they are not letting me do anything. And I know that's obviously the point of factions. He is being very mean to me. I'm just going to reply I'm raiding because that is what the server is about, you know? No, it's, it's a very simple thing. Okay, I think for the most part, these chest rooms seem to be fully raided. It doesn't seem to be that much left inside of here. Now, if there is and there's something very, very secret, I'm going to be very, very upset. But we got so much money out of this raid. We got a good amount of stuff. We have some invis potions. I'll drink one up now just for the fun of it. And we'll head up the ladder again. It didn't work. Okay, he came back in daily armor again. I don't think these guys understand that. Okay, he just keeps... Stop coming back. It's just going to keep happening. Oh, he came back 
fucking armor. Okay, I'm actually gonna die. This guy is insane. What just happened? Okay, warlord kit. Let's get some armor on. We are going back in armor. The good thing is I don't think we had any spawners on us. I think we literally just had like what we had on us, which is actually seems quite good. I knew someone was gonna come back in armor, but we have some stuff here with like custom enchants, so we should be okay. I'm quickly just gonna find out how to change texture pack. There we go, just so we have like low fire and a different sword. I know it's a bit of a change like midway through the video, but let's grab up some elixirs. Actually, did we get, oh, we got some from here. Drink up a combat elixir, and then we will also grab some potions and stuff as well. This could go very, very badly right now. Wait, he just took no knockback. I think he's cheating. Okay, I have to get out of this base because I have a really bad feeling that they're actually cheating. Now, I know this could just be seen as salt, but honestly, I think they are. Just the way he was doing those hits. Guys, leave it in the comments what you guys think as well. Oh my god, he actually chased me. He actually chased me? That is such a bad idea for him because <laughs> there's something I can do, which I've done before to toxic people, and it's definitely the most fun. If I F claim S2 right here and I go to base shop and I grab an annihilation core. If you guys don't know what this does, it pretty much, it pretty much removes the ground under the guy. So this should actually work if we can just get above him like right here. All we need to do now is just get out of combat and we hopefully should be able to do this. Come on, swim away, Raven. Swim away. That guy fell to his death. Come on. All I need to do is get out of combat and I'm okay. Come on. Okay, round here we go. Oh, this video has taken such like a bad turn. It's actually really surprising. Okay, if I get right here and I do it, no, he got me right back in combat at the last second. What is this? Am I just that bad at the game now? Okay, this guy's over here. Get the guy with no armor. Come on. There we go. We got him. I think we got his head as well. Come on. We just need to get this guy off of it for a second. We're about to get him. He's on one heart. Come on. This is all we need is just one more. Come on, buddy. We got him. Yes. We managed to get everything back. This went a lot better than I thought it would. I just hope they managed to come back because I really want to use this annihilation core. He's messing me. You are getting banned. I mean, I'm, I've recorded everything. Let's grab his head because this is actually worth so much money if we can get this because I think we sold one earlier for $400,000. Oh, is it, money's actually gone. His head is worthless, but I think I'll keep it in the PV for now or in the E-chest, I guess. Okay, we looks like we have no room in anything. I just messaged him and said GG because honestly, right, I don't want any bad feelings because obviously this is just factions. He said, ha ha ha. Uh, okay. Good thing my friend came in at the right time to kill you. Okay, I managed to get them to follow me again. I think, yeah. There we go. This is what I wanted. And then we will head over here, get out of combat. And I think we can leave this right now. Come on, I'm out of combat. Bye, buddy. <laughs> oh, I did it. <laughs> it worked. There we go. We'll have another one of his heads now for storage purposes. We'll put this back in the e-chest as well so we can stack these up. I don't think they're going to fall for that again, honestly. I mean, it was... Oh, there's his friend. Oh, it's him again. Okay. He said reported again. Guys, I think this is where we're going to leave this video. Leave in the comments if you guys have ever had probably a worst action experience ever. Like, if you have had anybody this toxic on the server or any server, please do let me know. I would greatly like to see it. Guys, let's see if we can smash 2,000 likes if we can. And I'll be fantastic. Thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys tomorrow with another video. I don't know what to do in factions anymore. This guy is crazy.